Next, John, unless your name's Dan Marino, your job is not safe with the Dolphins. And, you know, people were joking about that early in camp, but it has really turned out to be very true. The face of the Miami Dolphins continues to change, and the feet, too. Amy Postlewaite has the story in tonight's Dolphins Update. Uh, we've traded uh, Pete Stoyanovich uh, to Kansas City. And with that, Pete Stoyanovich was gone. It's been a great, great thrill for me and my family. But I'm going to take this and turn it into a, a big positive. After seven up and down seasons with the Dolphins, we've witnessed Stoya win some and lose some. He's become one of the top five most accurate kickers in the NFL, but that didn't stop Jimmy Johnson from trading him for a future draft pick. I think with what he's done for this organization, uh, he deserves to go to a quality football team, and that's why um, I felt good about uh, making the trade with Kansas City. The job now goes to second-year kicker Joe Nedney, whose performance in Monday night's game solidified his position. Both kickers battled hard for the job, and came out with a mutual respect for one another. Pete's going to be kicking at a, at a very good team, and I'm glad that he's, his career is, is far from over, and I'm glad it's not. You know, We'll both probably meet up in the future, and I'm sure we'll have a lot of good words to say to each other. He's got some big shoes to fill, but he's got a size 13 foot, so I hope he does well. Stoyanovich now finds himself kicking for a team with a legitimate shot at the Super Bowl. But today, he was only thinking about the team he'll leave behind. Oh. I'll miss this place. I'll miss this place a lot. I'm Amy Postawade for Fox 29.